This video tends to show us how to upload DNA sequence in the BioEdit software, create alignment, and make the consensus sequence. Recently, made a video showing how to choose the best sequence and how to edit it so you can see it in the next video so let us start uploading the files to the bioedit software and creating the consensus sequence So I choose the forward strand for this sequence. This is the reverse, this is the forward. So I'll first open the forward. So you can see these are the sequences, the peaks, the sharpness. So you see the quality. You can see in the beginning, the enzyme was very weak and there are no sharp peaks, but as we turn to 20, the peaks begin becoming clear. When you move on, as you turn to 600, the peaks are not as good, and as you turn to the end, they become more poor. If you increase the increase the strength of this you see the differences in better in peaks how better they are you can see this they are very good but as you turn to this side they become crowded and not very good as we have as we have seen before So that one is noted. So we come back here. Now we are going to upload an alignment file. So we come to import sequence alignment file. So we upload the reverse file. Press OK. So you can see these are two sequences. But we want to ship off the bad quality sequences at the end and at the beginning. So we had previously opened the, the forward now the forward strand now we are going to open the reverse strand and we see the quality and files we say open reverse and open like this we just take this off bring this here minimize this
so you can see it also has bad practice at the beginning let's first increase this it has good quality beginning from around 10 the quality improves 20 improves more around 30 we have attained stability and the sequence is better but as it in the end it becomes poor this is the reverse And this is the forward. So when you organize profiles like this, like this, so you, you can bring your file here like this, so that you create three screen, three screens in one like this. So you can see goes to reverse forward. Just in one. No need for having three computers like this. So you can see whatever you want to do, just like this. Now let us visualize the forward and make and ship off the that sequences the name like this like this I can see that from from here, my sequence is becoming better and better. But from here, the bands are not as sharp as this region. So I can choose to begin from here. Here, the pick is becoming better. So I can choose from here like this. So I know that from nucleotide number 17, I will ship it off. So if we come here, nucleotide 17, which is T, this one. So I come here. You have done this, 20 word. I click here. Select the beginning. So we also come towards the end. Just first increase this to see where the sequence is better. So you can see from here. If you want to understand here what my sequence is doing, let us hit in to this region. We are beginning to get peaks. Let's let us go we can start from here. Choosing where to ship from depends on the quality of the sequence. You see, all this is not clear, so we shall cut it off. So, from region, from C. 
seven eighty something. Where we have GGG. This region. Respect to the end. GGG, which is here. Come to edit. Select end. So I prefer first cutting off the end so that I remain with the beginning points for easy cutting. So I press the delete button in your laptop. It is deleted. So you come between the said 17. Since I, I first chopped off the end, I remain with the actual beginning points. 17, select the beginning, edit, select the beginning, and press the edit button. So we shall chop also the reverse. This. So when we come to the reverse, You can see around nucleotide 11. We shall chop off this. So we come here as TTT 11. TT. So you know, from there, we come to edit and select the beginning. Shall cut off that. So when we see at the end, that is the end. We say the sequence is not as good as we would think. So let us cut off. But as we see, it is better than the forward. But at the end, as we have seen, so let us cut off from this because that's where we see the pixel came to become better. T, so we cut off the last T. So when we come here, let's first cut off the end. Triple T, cut off the first T. 810. Come to edit, select to the end. Come here. Sequence eleven. We have say. This region. Eleven. We shall take the first T. Select the edit. Select the beginning. And you press the edit button on your computer. So we are finished clipping the sequences. So we shall choose this and make 
that we must complement. Expect nucleotide, nucleic acid, sorry, you select the nucleic acid. You got sequences, you select the nucleic acid. And you come and you choose reverse complement. So now we have the reverse complement of our reverse. So from there, we have to choose both sequences by pressing Ctrl R. So all of them are affected. So from there, we have to align the sequences. So you go back to sequence, you look for pairwise alignment. Allow to align two sequences right end to end. So minimize this. Then you can increase this. Then you can just do like this. So from this, from this new window, from this new screen, we shall, we shall create a consensus sequence. So you also select all and create a consensus sequence. You go to alignment and create consensus sequence so we can see how consensus sequence is formed and the next the next video shows how to make these edits how to choose which sequence to depend on in order to edit this sequence first of it all when you're going to edit you have to first come here and choose edit so bring your cursor to before the nucleotide you want to edit so if you have g and t you want to choose t According to which sequence is good. So if we choose G, so you you press caps lock on your computer and press G and it's edited. So you move on and on. So my next video shows which quality which quality of sequence you should depend on in order to make a good editing of the consensus sequence. Thank you very much.